Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Sick Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to change your password using a PC for your PlayStation 4 or 5 account. So let's go ahead and jump into the video right now. So let's say your PlayStation account got hacked or your PlayStation got stolen and you no longer have it. How would you go ahead and change the password on the account so no one can use it or buy stuff? So let's go over to my computer right now, open up a web browser, then in the URL, go to www.playstation.com, then hit enter. And it'll bring you to this page. Now in the upper right side of the screen, let's go to sign in and select this. Now type in your email address and password associated with your account. Then if you have two-step verification on, go ahead and type in the code that's being sent to you. And if you're worried about being hacked, make sure you set up two-step verification so no one can just sign in with your account. So let's hit verify now. Okay, so my account now has been signed in on the PC. Now let's go up to the upper right to our profile picture right next to the search bar. Select this. Now let's go to account settings. Then on the left side of the screen, let's go down to security. Then go to continue. Now under security, let's go to password and go to edit. Then type in your current password and then type in a new password and re-enter it. Now once you have this all filled out, go to next or save and it will go ahead and update that password on your PlayStation 4 or 5 account. Now back on your PlayStation 4 or 5, you will be signed out of your account. So you will need to go to settings. Then go to users and accounts. And then right to the right of account, there will be a sign in option where we can type in our new email address and our password. And we will have to log in with those two different credentials now. Otherwise, if you do not have the new password, you will not be able to play online or you won't be able to buy stuff from the PlayStation Store or you won't be able to sign in online at all. So if someone does have access to your account, they won't be able to play whatsoever. So this will protect your account and keep it secure and safe. And make sure you set up two-step verification then. So if this video did indeed help you out, go ahead and leave it a big thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel down below for more tech up videos coming up next on Your Six Studios.